welcome back to the Memory Lane Show on Spotlight TV. Now, here's what happened when I talked a little bit more to Sunita. Uh, well, let's go back to um, your X Factor days in uh, 2011. Um, now, you helped uh, to choose One Direction. and You've got like a really good eye, haven't you, for kind of sussing out the talent? So could you just say that again, a little slowly for yeah. Simon Cowell, that, uh, pardon, I've got what? <laughs> You chose, you chose. Thank you. Well, I know you did a lot of work behind the scenes, Sunita. One Direction, Leona Lewis, I mean, Olimers, oh, I was yeah. there with that one. Yeah. Uh, Fleur East. I, oh, I love her. I was Simon in the middle of her song and making, he started dancing because I was like, this is good. And he was like, yeah, 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 yeah. You know, like a lot of people that he, thought we're going to be risky, like he thought maybe Leona was too nervous and too shy. Um, Ollie messed up his words during um, the judge's home visit, and he was like, it's a bit of a risk. And then, of course, uh, what did we say? Who did we just say? Well, I mean, one D, I mean, that was, to be honest, to be honest, I didn't actually help put the group together, but at judges' houses, I was there to choose, but it was a no-brainer. I mean, it wasn't like I had to say, I didn't have to fight for them, let's put it that way. Yeah. They, they were in, they were going to the live shows, whether I liked it or not, but I, I love them, yeah. But it's nice, you really sort of nurture the talent, and I know that you've kind of been helping out uh, young people that are trying to get into the industry. Um, actually, a guy from my hometown called Henry Newbury. Oh, you know Henry? Yes, oh, yes. Oh, gosh. Um, He's one of my babies. Yes, isn't he brilliant? He's amazing. Yes, so I have this show that um, is probably going to be an online show, but we are talking to some uh, television companies about it as well, um, and Sony like it as well, called Atenis, and it's like a kind of edgier, I, I, mean, I don't even want to say X Factor, because it's not a talent competition, but it's a it's a, a talent capture of different artists from around the country, all different genres of music, ages, races, ethnicities, uh, uh, gender identities, like everything, Real a real diverse mix of music mm -hmm. and and I help nurture them and, and take them forward in the industry. And we've made a program all about it called Atten yeah. Henry's one of our guys. And I found him because I'm judges on uh, Pride's Got Talent. Pride's Got Talent. Yes, he won that. Yes. He was our last winner. And we also have Lamont, who won the year before, who's part of, who's part of my team. And part of the, the uh, prize when you win Pride's Got Talent is you get to work with me and I help to sort of mentor you for next year's performance on the main stage. But Henry and Lamont have sort of stayed with me and are doing Atonis, the TV show. And I just think, I mean, just phenomenally talented. Oh, and yes. Great pianist as well. It's just like, I wish I could be that talented. I can only talk. He, he could have played Elton John in, yeah. in Rocketman or, or, you know, any of those because he's, his voice is exceptional. His piano playing is ridiculous. And he's self-taught. Yes, I know. Just incredible. So... Yeah, big shout out to Henry Newbury in Farum. Thank you. <laughs> oh, I never told you I loved you. Words should be easy to say. Now, I mentioned earlier about Sunita's hit Toy Boy. I just think it's actually one of my favourites uh, from 1987. Let's have a little.
see you after the break where I'll be talking more with Sunita. I'll see you after this.